I say thank God to airplanes and social media and the knowledge that it can provide one who's wise enough to seek it for all the solutions that are available now. There was a time where uh, as a man, you were in a, in a caught in a, uh, in a no-win situation. On one hand, you needed women, you needed women as a normal heterosexual male that needs interaction with the female on all levels. And on the other hand, engaging with them uh, would make you go through so many steps, jump through so many loops and go through so many hurdles in order to be with them. And then after you had them, uh, you know, there all the all the demands uh, started. You know, where is this going? Uh, uh, what are you looking for? Uh, do you want to move in together? After you move in together, do you want to get married? Do you want to have kids? You know, what's my role in this relationship? You know, why did you do this? Why did you come home late? Uh, where were you? Etc. 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 All the things that you have to deal with in order to get what you want from a woman. And um, I mean, in all fairness, a woman also needs uh, some things that she should get from a man. But in the West, given the atrocious and unfair divorce laws written by, by some greedy, self-serving attorneys and, and judges who were ex-attorneys, and the way a men are treated in, uh, in a divorce situation, it makes marrying for a man that has any sort of uh, assets worth talking about a uh, economic uh, suicide that's like getting on a plane that has uh, you know th uh, three out of four engines uh, overdue for uh, for repairs and a pilot who's had a few drinks and, and a crew that does not want to be there uh, you know, uh, I say this uh, without trying to be funny or anything, but it, uh, given the West's, uh, and, uh, and I, by West I mean uh, United States, and Canada, and most of uh, Western uh, Europe, uh, and some parts of Japan, so divorce laws, uh, it just, if you have any assets worth talking about, you are, uh, you are basically entering a very dangerous, potentially dangerous situation that can permanently uh, destroy and change your life and change the course of your of your financial stability and your mental uh, and physical health but thanks god for airplanes and the knowledge you can get on a plane and go to certain places overseas and i'll be happy to divulge with you exactly where as someone who's been to 151 countries and uh, get your satisfaction, uh, the what you need from a woman, without abusing any of them, you know, in, in, a, in a healthy uh, exchange uh, situation. And uh, get your uh, needs met physically, uh, emotionally, and, and everything else without having to subject yourself to all the potential dangers and heartaches and tears and pain that you would in the West. Thank God for that. And you'd be a fool as a man not to take advantage of it. And I don't want to hear that I can't afford it. Because for the price of uh, going to many places overseas that I have in mind, uh, you know, it's much less than going to bars and spending money on, on drinks or, or, or uh, tickets to sport events and other meaningless things that will have absolutely no uh, impact on your life. So the, the, the basic point, very simple point of this video is, as a man, you need to be with a woman. You don't have to forego that need. You don't have to, uh, you know, um, deprive yourself of this. Get on a plane to certain destinations overseas and uh, you'll be faced with all kinds of sweet, feminine, feminine women. By feminine, I mean they look act and behave and talk and walk like a woman should. They are not uh, like in the West, uh, a, 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 a man in a woman's body. Career women, these feminists, these hard women that, that, uh, that want to act like a man and they, they nurture and they advise other women to act like a man. And at the same time, they, they talk down and hate all the things that, that, uh, that men do and call it uh, masculine tox toxicity. I hope you get the gist of what I'm saying in this uh, without getting any more into uh, details. I hope you understand. There are options available for you. Use your head.
there are airlines and there are destinations where you can get everything you want I'm not saying the nature of women is going to be different. The nature of women is the same universal, unless you find them on Mars or another or Jupiter or another planet. The nature of women is the same worldwide. However, people are a product of their behavior, of their surrounding. People are a product of their surrounding. And you will see that women in uh, certain parts of South America and, and uh, Asia and even uh, Eastern Europe, they behave like a feminine woman. They act like a woman and uh, they allow man to act like a man and interacting with them is so much more pleasant and the uh, the downsides are so much less than what you face in the west look for more details in the next videos all the best signing out from this beautiful golf course till i see you on the other side